This is problem number seven from the January 2015 Algebra Regents exam. <clears throat> and essentially, all we need to do is solve this inequality here. I'm going to start off by uh, subtracting... No, oh, actually, I'll add 2 thirds x to both sides of the inequality. And we'll do that to cancel that out. Okay, so we'll be left with 7 is less than... And then x plus 2 thirds x is... Uh, 5 thirds x uh, minus 8. Next up, we will add 8 to both sides to cancel that out. And we'll get 15 is less than 5 over 3x. Okay, um, and then essentially what we're going to do is multiply by 3 fifths. And by doing that, the th these 3s will cancel out and the 5s will cancel out. We'll do the same thing over here. Okay, um, so those cancel out, and we'll be left with uh, 15 uh, times 3 fifths, which is 9. And then if we're going to reverse the order of this inequality, it'd be x is greater than 9, which is option number 1. Also, just a heads up, um, there is another different way of solving this inequality. And to get rid of that fraction, another thing you could do is multiply every single term by 3. And then it would become 21 minus 2x is less than 3x minus 24. And that's just because I multiplied everything by 3. And that might make it a little um, not done with fractions a little bit easier. But yeah, in the end, you would get you would end up getting the exact same solution. All right, thanks for visiting JD's Regions Preparation.